macho, tu macho, ese es lobo. What's up, guys? What is going on? Waiting the shell, guys. There is fear everywhere. People are scared of what is happening around the world. Like, seriously? Oh my goodness. Did you all hear that? On Friday, our president, Donald J. Trump, declared United States national emergency. I'm telling you, since Friday, everyone is freaking out like, what the hell is going on? This coronavirus, my dear. We need Jesus. We need God. Let everyone start calling upon God. This is beyond human repair. It's only God that can do this. It's, it's, it's totally obvious. Like, we don't even know what to say about this, but to rely on God. He is the mighty Messiah. He is the healer of all sickness. He is the one who created this heaven and earth. There is no other one that can heal this disease. Like, if you search now, just research on CDC and listen to what they are saying. Center of Disease Control is telling me that <laughs> there is no currently like no vaccine to prevent coronavirus disease covid 19 seriously or oh, this is a joke or what lord have mercy god should help us run the world like this is overwhelming i don't know what to say and here they said older adults and people who have severe underlying chronic medical conditions like heart or lung disease or diabetes seems to be at higher risk for developing more serious complications from COVID-19 illness. Please consult with your healthcare provider about additional steps you may be able to take to protect yourself. Guys, like, they have shut down so many schools. No daycare, no school. The kids are at home. You can hear their voice. I'm sorry they are disturbing right now. I have not been able to do anything like to shoot any video because of my kids. Like, they're all over me. They are scared. Like, you have to comfort them. You have to talk to them. They're like, mom, what is going on? What is this? Only God can answer this question. I don't even know what to tell them. Only, please, take the proper precaution that we need to take wash your hand wash your face if you're sick wear masks and mind how you um interact with you know others like it's like everybody hiding themselves like be indoors you can't go to work moms that have kids you, you're not going to work it's not like maybe let's say in other countries maybe africa you have has help or you have your relative, your mother-in-law, everybody um, around you, you know, helping you. Here, nobody, like, it's just only you and your husband. No house help. No drive unless maybe the president or, you know, whoever. I don't know. No, no, it's only you and your kids and your husband. Unless if you have your mother, maybe your mother is here or, or any of your relatives is here helping you out. Or those that are for, 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 for let's say immigrants, is totally different. It's totally different. Let's say for maybe um, someone from another country living, you know, in the United States. You know, like you are the one doing everything by yourself. Everyone is freaking out. But I don't know. The only words of encouragement that I can give is that take the necessary precaution that you need to take and pray. Let's pray. As God said in First Thessalonians 
um, 5, 16 to 18. Pray with that season. Let's keep on calling upon God because He is the mighty healer. He is the Messiah. He is the only one that can set us free from this horrible situation because it's, 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 it's terrible. It's terrible. You know, I don't even know what to say about this. Like, okay, you're telling me the best way to prevent illness or is to avoid being exposed to this virus. The virus is thought to spread mainly from person to person between people who are in close contact with one another. So you have to be about six feet from the other person. Six feet gap from the other person because you don't know if the next person in front of you have it or not. My dear, the thing is around the world is all over all over, around the world. Father, please help us. Heavenly Father, we need your mercy. We need you. Please, God, come and help us. Now, steps to protect yourself. Clean your hands often. Wash your hands often with soap and water for at least 20 seconds, especially after you have been in public place or after blowing your nose, coughing or sneezing. Imagine, Walmart have to close 10 p.m. last night. 10 p.m. Walmart that used to work 24-7. They have to shut Walmart down last night. Like, seriously. Many, many, many um, stores, shopping centers are shutting down. And if you go to stores, you will not see like the necessary things now you need. Because since Friday, people have been buying things, even water, everything. Like, getting it ready in their home like don't go nowhere it's like go nowhere you have to be at home with the kids for four weeks four freaking weeks oh my goodness <laughs> no school no daycare you have to be at home with your kids this is it people in another country may say you know why is it over here i'm telling you the way it is here right now this is the way it is now if soap and water are not readily available use a hand sanitizer that contains at least 60 percent of alcohol cover all surface of your hands what they mean by alcohol there is you know like the spirit i think in african countries it's been called spirit you know um cover all surface of your hands and rub them together until they feel dry avoid touching your eyes nose and mouth with unwashed hand really until you wash your hand, no touching of your face or anything. This is from CDC. This is from C. This information is from CDC website, like Center of Disease Control. Avoid contact. Avoid close contact with people who are sick. Put distance between yourself and other people if COVID-19 is spreading in your community. This is especially important for people who are at higher risk of getting very sick. Stay home if you are sick. Stay home if you are sick, except to get medical care. <laughs> Cover, cough, and sneeze. Cover your mouth and nose with a tissue. When you cough or sneeze, use the inside of your elbow. Like, you know, you have to cough like this. Immediately wash your hand with soap and water for at least 20 seconds. If soap and water are not readily available, clean your hands with a hand sanitizer that contains at least the um 60 percent alcohol the same thing wear a face mask if you are sick a lot of people now wearing face masks may god help us guys i have not been able to vlog anything like since this week like everyone running helter skelter calling upon god to come and help us i don't even know it's only god can answer this question you can hear the voice of my kids out there like i have been like pleading so with them baby please keep quiet let me see if i can do something oh my goodness 
they are all over like you can't leave them and go anywhere they're like mom where are you going to come back here stay with us you don't want this together i pray god please cover us with your blood you shed on cross of calvary like these things stop spreading lord please oh my goodness i don't even know what to say clean and disinfect frequently touch surfaces daily this include tables doorknobs light switch countertops handles decks phone keyboard toilet faucets sinks like everything everything you have to clean you have to clean everywhere everywhere like massive cleaning to stop the spread of this virus guys everyone is 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 scared people are freaking out may god help us put united states in prayer put the whole world in prayer wherever you are like i don't even know what to say i don't even know what to say but i believe the almighty god will help us the mighty messiah the creator of heaven and earth the greatest physician look if the doctors the doctors the nurses pray for them pray for them put them in your prayers please because they are the one taking care of the kids taking care of the sick i mean like i don't know i don't know guys guys i don't even know what to say anymore thank you guys for listening thank you guys for watching i will see you guys on my next video and if you have not subscribed guys go ahead and subscribe let's keep on praying and see what the lord will do for us i hope all this um spreading of this coronavirus will stop as soon as possible in jesus